Here we can see a cone and a plane parallel to the base of the cone cuts it. That time two parts of the cone are formed. One upper will be the smaller cone and the part with the base is the frustum of the cone. So we will study about frustum of a cone. In our day to day life we find different objects which are frustum of a cone like the buckets, glasses, these are examples of frustum of a cone. A frustum of a cone will have two radii, bigger R1 and smaller R2, perpendicular height H and slant height L. We can find the volume of the frustum cone using the formula 1 upon 3 pi h in the bracket r1 square plus r2 square plus r1 into r2 and complete the bracket. Curve surface area of the frustum cone is calculated using the formula pi r1 plus r2 in the bracket multiplied by l where L is the slant height and that is equal to in the square root h square plus r1 minus r2 bracket square. And total surface area of the frustum cone can be calculated using the formula pi L in the bracket r1 plus r2 plus pi r1 square plus pi r2 square.